Yo, what's poppin' YouTube? It's your team leader, The Random Gamer, here with a vlog. I have not done this in a long time, um, but I just thought I'd do a little vlog. Um, mainly it's just updating you on about what's going on and telling you the fact that I am not editing and uploading things because I am in college right now. So college is priority and um, is main priority and I didn't really have much going on right now. So, um, I just thought I'd do a quick little short video, you know, saying, you know, telling me to talk about what's coming up, what I have planned for, um, next upcoming videos that will be uploaded whenever it is whenever it gets uploaded and hopefully um and some of those videos are to a lot of a bunch of those videos are toy reviews but before that i'd like to finish um the line of videos of the albany weekend i did you've got a sample of some of that from the con you saw some of the concert videos that i posted from the actual concert i went to but there was a whole video where i did of um dude perfect of the dude perfect tour that I went to a show that I went to on that same weekend. So um, stay tuned for that. And um, yeah, and the then after that, I'll do videos that are as simple, go back to doing videos that are as simple as uh, recording, editing, posting, again with uh, toy reviews, uh, which I got like five, no, not five. I have like six, maybe seven reviews I have to do um but one thing I will show show you is something that I got at a um that I got at a fair a craft fair I guess you could call it they call it a holiday event at, it's in, it was in Vermont and um but um at one of the booths that was there, there was a gentleman that was on a show called Forge and Fire. His name is, I'm not going to say his first name, partially because, sorry dude, but I can't remember. Uh, but I just know because his his, uh, com his thing is called um, Spangler Forge. And he had all his blades there and stuff, and he had different all these different things. And he also had um, uh, Viking ruins that are made of metal. And each one had a different symbol, and he and in the and when you bought one, he ended up giving you a little card that says what the meaning is. Um, I haven't looked into what the two that I bought. I'm I bought the two the two ruins that I bought. I bought mainly because the two symbols you put them next to each other and they make my initials. <laughs> but um, not my YouTube initials, my real life initials. For those of you who know who what my real name is, um, but. Um, I would say, I would definitely say that um, I really do, I really am glad that I got these. And I'm gonna show these off to you guys before I get into talking about more on, on YouTube videos and stuff. Um, so, and I'm gonna be experimenting something too in one of my videos, which I'll get into more on that as well. But um, right now I'm just gonna show off my little See, that should say... So this is the front. You can see them. There we go. Now I can see them. So that's the front of them. And it's really cool. These are, I think, as simple as these are, it probably wasn't that simple to make, but as simple as they look, they look really cool. And in the back, they have the guy's logo stamp on it. You know, it's an anvil with a sword. A sword in an anvil and I asked the guy about it and he said he got the idea from the sword in the stone uh, legend which I thought was pretty neat in himself in it in, 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 uh, in itself but um, the card itself I will show you after I put these back in their little pouches um, there we go and I'll also show you his now I'll just show you the back of his little um, 
his card he that he put in there, but this is this is the um This is the front here of the with all the symbols and the representations. I have the one that looks like a B, which is down here. And then the one that looks like a P, which should be uh I'm trying to remember where it was. <laughs> I know it's on here. Where did it go? Oh, there it is. It's up right. Camera will focus on it. I'm using my phone actually, so I'm not actually using a camera. Um, eh, anyways, but um, come on, focus on it. Focus. There's a tap thing. Anyways, it's it's there. And um, the B symbol represents the Burkanian growth. I hope I'm saying that right. And um, the one that looks kind of like a P, um, the letter P, is the Wonjo Joy. So I'll have to look in. I'll look at more into those and what they what they mean and what they what they mean and stuff um later what each one means but um yeah i just thought these were really cool and now i'm going to show you the back of mr spangler's oh i just realized on his car this is the first thing right there but i'm still gonna say mr spangler out of respect to the guy because i really expect the guy Re respect uh respect the guy and um his blades look so cool, by the, by the way. I wish you guys could have seen it, and I wish I um, thought to take a, at least a picture of them. They looked really cool. and um, But this is the back of his card here. That's what the back of his card looks like. You know, it's got S for Spangler and F for Forge, and then Spangler Forge on the bottom and stuff. So, you know, I'm really glad I met the guy because I didn't necessarily remember the episode he was in but he was in um one of the episodes of uh, season six of forge and fire and he's he was saying he said that he was in the episode where they took a snow where they gave each contestant a snowmobile and i think he said in it's either at the end of the beginning where they ended up giving they said here's a snowmobile now use something from that to build your blade or make your blade and honestly, being able to make anything out of a snowmobile is pretty cool. <laughs> but um, no, all right. So back on to back on topic. I'm gonna get a sip of water here. Not sponsored by Propel, by the way. Um, even though I love Propel water, that's I get Propel water every time I walk downtown and go by mobile uh, when I walk to school from work. And uh, Kind of thing here. Um, oh yes. So one. So in my toy reviews that I'm gonna do, I'm gonna. There's gonna be at least one out of the three smaller figures that I have to record. I'm going to try and do it very short and sweet. Um, try to see if I can get it within three minutes ish. That's my goal. <laughs> try to get it within three minutes because I'm considering um, expanding my social medias to TikTok. I'm considering it. Not haven't 100% decided yet, but I'm considering it so that way I have a way to kind of share my channel and get more active on my YouTube channel again. But um, yeah, and uh, I also hope I get to I get to do uh, do some more videos with this camera here, my night vision camera that would be cool if i can do some night uh some videos with this it can do night vision and regular so the night vision is not the green kind it's um it's um i think the green one the green night vision is infrared and this is um and then this is the gray kind of night vision the gray version of night vision um, I don't know what that one is called, but um, I think that one's a type of infrared too, but it's a nice little camera that I plan to 
use once I figure out a, what editing program I could use on my computer. Um, yeah, but uh, for now, the my main concentration is schooling and getting my schooling done. That's my main thing. And, um, yeah. So, uh, oh yeah, another thing I was going to show that I don't think I showed when I originally got it. I did a video on where I got it when they when I went to Monshire and they had this dinosaur these dinosaur events going on and the two dinosaur skeletons. But I don't think I showed you the um uh repli replica fossil tooth that I got at the gift shop at the gift shop. And this is the this is a replica of a fossil allosaur tooth, which honestly I think is really cool because just because it just gives you the idea of how of this is just one of their teeth. Now just imagine a whole row of these. I don't know if you can see the serrations on there, but there's serrations on these teeth. If it'll let if it'll zoom in on it, there's serrations all across there, and it goes around to the top here too oh you can kind of see it on um, the serrations and imagine a whole mouthful of these teeth in the on a dinosaur that i don't know how fast the allosaurus could run but the allosaurus this is from this is an allosaurus tooth i probably said that already but um the allosaurus was the king of the Jurassic. You have the king of the dinosaurs, the T-Rex. Well, the Allosaurus was the king of the da king of the dinosaurs while it was alive, while it was alive in its time. And then when the Cretaceous period came along, T-Rex came along, and the Dr Allosaurus died. Uh, Allosaurus either was around and was killed off or something. Um, I don't know how far in the Cretaceous period the Allosaurus was around, but the Allosaurus was the top predator, the lion of the Jurassic, as they called it, um, during the Jurassic period. So, yeah, I just thought I'd share that because I don't think I've showed it, showed this off to anywhere anywhere else. I've showed it to people on a, on Zoom, to, to a couple people on Zoom before that I talked with and stuff, but, uh, yeah. But, uh, also, I've shown this to multiple people and I'm sure people have seen it when I'm when I'm sitting there or I have my phone sitting on the on the table or something. But um, I have a new case on my phone, and it is this, and auto obviously an auto transformers thing. Um, but I don't know if it'll focus. But there, it's this is called blue Trent, uh, blueprint, and the reason being is because this whole thing has. Um, the whole thing here has different yeah you can kind of see it you can see like robot transformer blueprints on there you can kind of see yeah you can kind of see the blueprints of the different transformers and stuff on it which i thought was really cool because it's blue and it has a bunch of transformers on there and it's the transformers right on the side of it too so um yeah this is the case i have on my phone um I probably shouldn't have put that part on there, but, you know, I just thought, just trying to update you guys on different things and that's going on lately, and, yeah, but, I hope to do more videos more often, but I don't think so. The main concentration will be getting homework done, especially, um, trying to do good enough to pass, and I know I will. I... I'm smart, I can do I can do that, I can pass, but it's just that it would be it'd be hard to do what I originally went originally going to college for, which is recording videos for my YouTube channel to get better at that. Um But uh yeah. So I hope you enjoyed that little vlog and um I hope that you guys look forward to the next videos that get uploaded whenever they do. I will be, they won't be as often as they normally would. They would be kind of 
gradual. They will be kind of gradual, and um, I'm probably gonna work on the video, the video from the concert I went to, or the last time I went to Albany. Actually, no, is that Albany weekend adventure? I'm gonna edit, finish editing the one that's in progress right now. Um, after I edit this video and get that done, and yes, I have a little wire in my hand, but um, yeah. Let me know what you want me to do um, in the comments down below of what you'd like to see me do. Um, you know, if you can think of like quick, simp quick and easy videos that are really quick to record and then would be quick to edit, I would do I would do them. But um, you know, I might come down to for a while until I get through college. I'll be doing um, like really short. Uh, this is probably going to be the last video that's going to be in the double dig double digits. It'll, I'll probably, if I post any, it'll, I'll probably be trying to do them where they're short and sweet and single digit videos, if you know what I mean. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I'll talk to you guys in the make, in the next one. If you enjoyed, make sure you, make sure you subscribe to my channel, destroy that like button, demolish that post notification button, and comment down below and... If you want to share this video, it may not be the perfect time to be um, trying to spread the word, but I'm still going to spread the word about my channel so that way um, people, because I have tons and tons of videos that people could watch on my channel. <laughs> so if they want to go from old to oldest video to newest video, they can do that. If they have a bunch of time, if somebody has a bunch of time to kill, you can do that if you're a new subscriber. And for those of you who have subscribed recently, thank you very much. And um, I hope you enjoyed my videos and, you know, feel free to go through them and watch it. <laughs> go through oldest to newest and watch how I've grown on this channel. I've basically taught, I've pretty much taught myself on, I've pretty much grown with this channel pretty much since I started in 2015. So, uh, in June 2015. So, yeah, but uh, I'll talk to you in the next one, guys. Peace out.